How's it going, everyone? Welcome to the next League of Legends video. We're playing some more Soraka support, and we are running an Airy Page, Airy Manifold Celerity, Gathering Storm, Second Wind, and Revitalize. We're fighting against a Senna, Zyra, bot lane. I'm assuming Zyra is the APC because they've got teleport. Not Ignite, not a combat summoner. Uh, we're just going to give a quick little leash to our Lee Sin, help him get out a little faster. It looks like Zyra has already shown up in lanes, looking to push as soon as possible. Interesting. I mean, we'll definitely take Every step, if you our minions uh, not being denied. And try and kill these plants, get a little extra gold on us. And this game's gonna be a game where we're probably gonna have to pick up a Mikhail's. And it's gonna be very brawl heavy with how this comp is. What must be done. Well, the enemy comp. I mean, look at them Camille, Velvet, and Graves. Very bursty, very head on. So, we'll even be able to get our um, Moonstone this game. Or maybe we'll just need more utility than heals. I think Moonstone will definitely be something we'll have to pick up because we'll get easy Qs out uh, with how melee they are. But Zyra and Sen are going to be hard to reach. So we're going to have to keep our front line alive as best as possible, or to play the Jin and Lux's first. Whichever works best. Maybe Yone will take a split push this game while the rest of us fight. We'll try and get this cannon. We got the Senna. Keeping Jin's HP up is very, very important since they have tons of poke on their end. And our HP is at max as well, so... If they stay on our side of the map, we can probably get a gank from Lee Sin. I don't think Sen has pulled a soul from me as yet. Just gonna step back, let the soul or the debuff go away. For peace of mind. And first blood from our Lux. But she also dies. Lee Sin's fighting Belveth. Looks like he's winning. But you can never really know with a Belveth. She is level 4 too, so probably best to just walk away. She is CSing better than our Jin, but I'm assuming that's because the plants are helping her last hit. Also, being shoved in the tower does make it difficult to get um, some minions. Because the tower is taking them out. But that's okay. I'll just ping for help. And see if Lee Sin will pass down. I mean, there is a scuttle crab that does need to be taken. Unless Belveth got her already. The whole world in battle. I'm not going to go up and go for a root yet. Oh, I got rooted. I think I messed up that minion for Jin there. Survival's key. The less damage you can take, the better. Oh. Uh, if Senna got rooted by Jin, we could have gotten so much damage off there. I'll use my other potion. She's still landing those Qs on me, the Senna. I lend my aid. And Zyra's out of mana. So if we happen to get their next rotation out, we can probably run them down. Get another heal off. Should be a dead center here. Very good stuff. I don't have silence to continue here. But let's just shove this wave in as best as we can. Huh, no W? That's fine. We'll get two points in our heal. He did get the cannon, that's good. Let's clear this wave as fast as we can. Zyra is TPing back, so she's not going to miss many minions, but at least it's under her tower. To heal and protect. 
we'll back out now. 40 CS to 47 on Zyra. I'm not getting stopped. Is Jin getting stopped? No. CDR shoes picked up. For peace of mind. I was thinking Swifties might be a good one too, but that's okay. If they run at us, we'll just use our silence. We'll try and get away, but I don't think we're going to go with a speedy build to this game. Just big this heals. Because they have a ton of burst. And we do have two glass cannons to protect in our back line. I'm gonna try and be present. Unfortunately. Oh. And we got it. both of them. Good. So, as we were, gonna go back and take this Drake. See what happens when you're trying to fight um, against people and they're not focusing you. It's good to try and find an aggressive position on them if you're able to, especially in a numbers advantage. So that when you do take out one, you can continue running down the next person. I lend my aid. Especially when you have heals like Soraka. Being able to sustain yourself. Drop another heal. She has faded ashes. That's fine. It's not gonna do much. We have level six now. Oh my goodness, so many plants. Or at least uh, deter the Zyra from continuing here. Make her back out. This plant is attacking me a lot. I don't have um, a charge to kill that cannon. No! Goodbye, cannon. Can we get this plate here? Thank you for that. I love walking up, getting Q, and then walking out immediately. Oh. I'm gonna throw an ult because I'm seeing a fight over on this. Very nice. Alright, my ultimate was useful. Is Jin backing or is he gonna stay? This is why you gotta keep your eye on your minimap. Because your team depends on your ultimate. I'm trying to throw like a sneaky Q, which isn't really that sneaky, but I'm trying to make sure it actually lands. See, I can't help Lux now, but Camille apparently went mid. By the time that I get to that fight, I'm probably not going to be able to participate in it anymore. I'm dead here. Jin just walked out. Yeah, he could have been there to take out uh, the Zyra. What was I going to go for? It wasn't um, Moonstone first. It's going to be Mikhail's. Can I get there? Nice, they failed to dive. Gracefully. Glad that that happened. Where uh, he lived. I should go and collect this wave. 
this experience is massive here for myself because you know supports don't usually get solo experience uh son i got the plate that's okay Looks like we're getting the next three Void Grubs. So, both Every sides have three Grubs. A new journey. I'm going to start putting some aggressive wards out in their jungle so we can see where Belvet's pathing is. No! I cast it out a second too late! I thought she was going to live for, like, barely any HP. Shut down. That's unfortunate. I, if I didn't flash and healed, would I have lived as well? Not sure. Where am I needed? Well played on her part. To heal and protect. Is it the same Drake Order as last game that I was playing on my last recording attempt? I think it was. So, them pushing the tower as much as they have is just a product of their composition. Also a product of uh, Jin being a little bit more scared. But he does have three kills, so we're just gonna have to accept that we're gonna be down some gold. It's not that big of a deal, honestly. We'll hit this, drop this ward back here, because it's that one's dying. I'm getting some extra gold from that control ward. Very nice. Jin and I was able to help Lux kill the Graves. Four kills for Jin. Jin should be able to ult here. I don't think we get anything out of it. He waited a little too long to ult. I'm gonna go back to base, but not until I heal him up first. Nice, a rampage for Lee Sin. Here's our Mikhail's gonna work on redemption. And this is like the standard build that I used to go before they introduced Moonstone. Oh nice combo. Double kill? Okay. I do have my ult in 55 seconds. Zyra does a significant amount of damage, huh? At least Aerie can mitigate some of the burn damage. Ooh, Lux might be in some trouble. Good thing we were there. See if I can help in any way. Ooh, bit of a dive. 
We'll quit this place. Get a ward down here. Uh, don't know if I trust this position right now. To heal and protect. I'll take that. I can't believe Graves checked that again. Your team has destroyed a turret. For peace of mind. Velvet is run. Ooh, hello. Mm, I was just dead. I was on vision. I wasn't paying attention to myself there. Always keep a good look on your surroundings when you're trying to run through somewhere, especially an uh, open lane. Ooh, nice ult. Okay. Yoni's still alive, at least. This is my path. Okay, so we're level 9. Senna's also level 9, but we're 2, 2, and 8 to her 1, 4, and 3. We used our Mikhail's already, but we should be up by the time that we fight Drake. Is there any vision in this bush? They didn't put a ward down. They just killed me. We'll get some... Perimeter wards around the Drake. There's no Scryer there. On my way to mid tower. <laughs> he ulted out. Gracefully. You know, it feels weird healing without Moonstone now. I'm gonna ult my Yone, see if he stays alive. Or he can just hold their attention for a little while. Goodbye, Graves. I lend my aid. We also got the Ignite from Graves. So Mountain Drake should be ours. A little bit more sustain, so all that poke and burn and all those other nonsense damages. Rampage. Helps me out a lot. My luck's killing it. I didn't know if uh, Camille's next Q was gonna one-shot my Lux, because she does have Trinity. So I just flash shield and Oh, so the visuals kind of break when you're in smoke screen on the Rift Herald. I just noticed that. Ryan, get out of here? No. That's three ults used on me. I'll just taunt them a little bit. I do have my ultimate for the Baron fight. If we ought to go do that. We currently have 31% heal and shield power. So we do have a Chemtech Drake. To heal and protect. Well, Belveth was down there. So that means an easier Drake to get. There's no need for me to use my ultimate here. Has been slain. Graves, if he tries to fight us, he can't really do anything. Okay. 
I wonder if Jin committed to his back if he would have uh, been able to get out. Since we are up here, we might as well try and commit to putting vision down. This is my path. I don't know why I put two wards in the same area. That's actually just a waste of vision. But we got our Oh, hello. I ulted my uh, Yone there, keeping him alive as best as I can. Are we still able to chase them? Doesn't look like there's anything we can get out of this. Oh, Jin? I got vision down so I could at least see. I'm gonna try and keep Lux alive. Very nice. Good work, team. Okay, 2, 3, and 14. And we have Redemption and Mikhail's. Both are on cooldown. Every step, a new journey. We already cleared 60 uh, debuffs or crowd controls on our Mikhail's. We've already healed 455 with the Redemption. So it would have been nice if I had silenced one second earlier so that she couldn't dash out. That's something that I'm working on, is like silencing a lot sooner. I don't want to step up here. Just give some heals. Ow! The plants are hurting. This is the road to Oh, I could have ulted that. I'm so sorry, Yone. That's on me. Got you. That's a dead Senna. Luxroot is so deceptively long. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. Uh, we don't need to be here anymore, right? Lux has no mana. There we go. What am I gonna pick up next? Dodcore? I've been healing quite well without Moonstone. I think Dawncore is good. Who is Lux caught? I might be caught. Ooh, dodging the Belva. Yone? At least you have Mountain Soul. So their Belva is down, that means they have Zyra and Senna to defend waves. Graves too. I keep forgetting that Graves is the champion here. Trying to get uh, Lee Sin out of the line of fire by using Mikhail's. This gen has missed so many ults. Let's go down Mountain Drake too, is that while we're healing up with our Qs, our ults, uh, the health that we're healing won't be as interfered with. 
Crazy, huh? Not bad. That's all three in heads down. We should probably be able to end right here. Oh, Camille's definitely done. <laughs> Just standing there. All right, and that's the game. Four. Did you play? Victory. All right, thirteen, two, and five on Jin. Not bad. Let's take a look at our score line here. Uh, well, let's give Great Shot Calling to Lux because they honestly won the early game for us. Even though they did start out with like four deaths, like they were honestly the person that started the momentum of the game. 9 0 and 14, Lee Sin. Wow. Yeah, both of them deserve honors. Let's see how much healing we did. 21,000 healing in a 27 minute game. 30,000 total healing. Vision score was 69 to 49 for Senna. We had 1,177 airy shielded. We had 2,505 bonus healing with revital with yeah, with revitalize and extra distance of 9,224 movement with our celerity. So this is just a standard game. It kind of feels good to get back into using Redemption into Mikhail's, just the utility items. Shame there's no more Ingenious Hunter, so we can reduce those cooldowns. But, um, yeah, it felt good to win that game with like that. I mean, it just seemed like they were all breaking down by the end of the game. While the Graves did seem like he was a menace early on, we just kind of out-sustained them and outplayed them the whole game, so... Hey, we survived a crazy poke lane, bot side, even though we did lose first tower. Um, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. So if you guys did enjoy, feel free to drop a like on the video, comment if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. Subscribe if you want to see more Soraka gameplay. And check out the Twitch stream at twitch.tv slash underscore. Link is in the description below, and I'll see you for the next video. Adios.